Hey guys, this is Will from Going Awesome Places. Well, if you remember a couple years ago, we got our very first hammock, the Kamek Roo Single and Dragonfly. And if you watch that video, you'll know that we had a lot of trouble setting it up for the first time, and it was because of the trees. We picked trees that had way too large of a trunk and trees that were way too far apart. So I was really excited when I heard of Kamek's brand new product, the Swiftlet, which is a portable hammock stand. And I was really curious to find out whether it would live up to its motto, being able to hammock from park to patio. Well, it's finally here, and just like last time, I'm gonna show you how to set it up for my very first time. Okay, let's set this up for the first time. This is, everything's contained in the bag, and there's two of the arms, and looks like, okay, we got two legs here. Oh, everything has nice pockets that keeps it contained. And we're doing lounge mode, which means the longer middle bar. So we got all the parts that we need. Oh, everything, they got these metal buttons. So really just push, clicks in. Okay, it's nice. Really simple, just the two legs there. And it stands up on its own. That's important. I'm gonna do these two legs. So again, press the button, pop it in, pop it in. They click in place. Need a bit more space. And okay, so we got the middle bar, slide it in, same click mechanism. And we're gonna do the same over here. You can do it all yourself. It's actually pretty easy and that's it. It's set up. The last step is the hammock, of course. Just gotta open this up. And of course, I already had this from before, which was nice. We didn't need to get a brand new hammock or anything like that. And pretty intuitive, we got the clips here. Uh, this is adjustable, but we're gonna click this in. That's one side. Bring this over. Click in place. I like that height. Jumping in. And we're all done. Swiftlet has a second mode and it's called chair mode. And so I'm gonna show you how it's done. There's one piece right in the middle. This is for the shorter chair mode and I'm gonna set it up. All right, so I think I can do this without taking the hammock off, which is awesome. And it really is about taking the middle bar off. So pull this off, it stands on its own. Press the button, pull out. This is done. Got the shorter bar, but we do have to bring it in closer. So, shorter chair mode bar goes in on one side, slide it in on the other, and then we're good to go. But you'll notice that there's a lot of sag here, and that's because, uh, well, it's a long hammock, and we need to shorten this up and tighten it up for chair mode. And the way you do that is, it looks like with these arms, on both sides have adjustable points, and all these holes here, there are 11 of them on each side, and all you do, pull this out, and pull down and something like that looks good. So it's pulling this down and we need to make this tight for chair mode. So maybe something like that. And chair mode activated. Now, one thing that I'm curious about is how this will work with the Dragonfly. Will it work with the Swiftlet? I'm not sure. Let's try it out. Okay, so I remember with the Swift, uh, so I remember with the Dragonfly that I have to thread this through. So I'm actually gonna take this off first. And I'm gonna open this up. Okay. And we're gonna bring it through as the first step. If I clip this back on, what happens with the dragonfly? I think the challenge is that there's actually no tree that you can anchor this on. So I can stretch this out, I'm gonna cinch this down 
I think the problem is, so I can cinch this down. Okay, so this loop is closed, but these ropes aren't gonna really have a place to go. Because typically, this will have somewhere to tie to. This will have somewhere to tie to. I mean, we don't have that. But technically, I mean, it's, it's just not super tight. But I'm going in. If you're really worried about mosquitoes in your backyard, yes. Okay, this works. I'm protected. <laughs> the dragonfly is literally just on me because there's nothing to hold it up like that, right? So it works, but kind of not really at the same time. <laughs> the Swiftlet has four main features that we'll talk about. It's portable. It comes with a travel bag, which means that you can easily chuck it into your car and pick it back up to go to your hammock spot. Now, one thing is that it's a little bit long, but at 50 inches, it's still workable. And I'd like to see maybe a little bit more padding on the side to help when you're carrying it those long distances. The bag itself is durable. And one thing I really do appreciate is that if you open it up, there's a lot of space inside, which means you can put all of your hammock gear. It's adjustable. Lounge mode and chair mode is pretty sweet to have. And so whether you have tight spaces indoors or just need a place to sit, you can set it up in chair mode. Or if you're looking for the traditional setup, you can set it up in lounge mode and put your own hammock, whether by Kamek or another brand, to your specific comfort by using these 11 adjustable points. It's lightweight. Coming in at 15 pounds, it's easy to carry, lift, and set up. This frees you from finding the perfect pair of trees. And while, is it ultra lightweight? No, but it's the perfect balance between being light and sturdy. It's also easy to set up. With eight clicks, you can set up your hammock and swiftlet just like that. It's a piece of cake. It's just a well-built and well-thought-through product that any hammock owner can use and can handle all sorts of spaces and terrain. Now the Swiftly can handle 400 pounds of weight and can evenly distribute that weight over uneven ground. And the materials that they use are rust resistant, which means you can leave the Swiftlet outdoors and not have to worry about rain. Plus, it's got lifetime warranty. Over the next month, we'll be putting the Swiftlet to the test and using it in a whole bunch of different scenarios. Overall, I gotta say, I am super impressed with the Kamek Swiftlet. It's one of those things that you don't realize you need until you have it, and once you do, you're gonna wanna bring it everywhere with you. Now, it may not be the smallest thing, but it is light enough to be travel ready. So there you have it. This is the Kamek Swiftlet with the Roo Single. Now go out and explore your newfound hammock freedom.